Okay. Welcome you to the My Econ presentation tonight. Some very motivated and excited person got with you and said, hey, you got to see what is going on. Hey, you got to understand what in the world personal financial success is. And tonight you are going to get blessed with some information that can change your life. My name is John Pettifordell, Executive Vice President, Infinity with My Econ. This system has totally changed my life, ladies and gentlemen. Let me give you my story very quickly. I got involved in business many years ago. I used to be a shift manager for Marriott. I did that, and I started to realize something. I realized that I was not going to make enough money to do all the things I wanted to do for me and my family. So I started to search in that what in the world could I do to change that. I looked at no money down real estate. I looked at vending machine businesses. You name it, I checked it out, okay? And I fell into this little thing called networking and direct sales. Now, I had no clue on what networking and direct sales was all about, but it just looked like it made sense. It looked like a very good thing to me, okay? But here's the thing. I had no experience, so I fell flat on my face. I did not know how to make it work, but I was bitten by the entrepreneurial bug. It made sense to because they, they introduced me to a concept called residual income. Now, I want you to think about that. That's when you work one time and get paid multiple times into the future. And I said, man, that just sounds like a really, really good thing to me. So I continue to work at it. Now, I met a gentleman by the name of Mr. Alvin Curry, this guy right here, okay? Alvin Curry changed my life. He was worth about $10 million when I met him. And he says, John, I want to teach you everything I know about business, money, capitalism, and finance. He had been in business for about 20 years. I said, man, that sounds good to me because I didn't know when the next time a millionaire was going to want to care enough about me and teach me something. So I took everything he said to heart and it changed my life. At the age of 34 years old, I was able to fire my boss. I have not worked a job since November of 2007, and I have absolutely no intention on going back. My wife and I, we live by this principle, all the things that we teach here at My Econ. So we, we own our house free and clear. We own all our cars free and clear. We have absolutely no credit card debt. Now, I don't say that to brag, but I say that to say that there's fruits in what we do, and we live by these principles. But let's talk a little bit about my econ, the personal financial success company. See, we're not the coffee company. We're not the juice company. We're not the travel company. We're the personal financial success company. See, I would say this. What is the number one product in the world? The number one product in the world is money. It is not travel. It is not nutrition. It is not coffee. It is not tea. It's not wraps. It is money. See, everybody is selling all that stuff to get money. See, people are going to school $30,000, $40,000 to get some more what? Money. Marriages is breaking up over what? Money. People is praying 90% of the time over what? Money. So we created a business based on helping people get free money. See, let's talk about that. See, we're going to talk about personal financial success. But let's talk about my econ very quick. We're an 11-year-old debt-free technology-driven company. We didn't borrow a dime from anyone to put this company together. But the key is this number at the bottom. We've been able to help our associates cash flow over $300 million. See, you're going to hear people in my econ say, I've cash flowed 20000 I've cash flowed 50000 I've cash flowed 500000 We can We put all those numbers together. We've helped our associates generate over $300 million in cash flow. And we have a 12-month plan to put another $100 million in cash flow in people's pockets. The question is, do you want some? Do you want to be a part of that? Okay? So now, let's talk about this. See, we're the personal financial success company. I want you to think about this, and I want to paint a picture for you. See, it doesn't matter if you're a doctor, a lawyer, a school teacher, whatever it is you do for a living. See, you got two unique financial objectives. Number one, you want to have income for today. See, this is why you work your job. So you trade time for money. But here's the problem. One day down the road, you're not going to be able to trade time for money. You're either going to get too old to work, you're going to decide you don't want to work, or the job is going to fire you. And when that happens, you got to have another source of income. That income has to come from income-producing assets. That's anything that you own that brings you money regardless of you working. But now let's talk about it. Let's put some numbers to this. See, I've talked to eight or 9,000 people about personal financial success, and I have not found 50 people on track. See, let's say you make $75,000 a year household income today. 
the question you must ask yourself is how much assets do I need in source two to replace this income? So you would need it 10 times what you make in a year. So you would need $750,000 in your 401k. You would need $750,000 in your uh, IRA. And most people are not on track to get any of this done. See, most people I talk to, they think if I have a couple of hundred thousand in, the, in my investment account, I'm going to be okay. No, you need several hundred thousand. Most people need seven, eight, nine hundred thousand, maybe even a million dollars in the retirement account to have the same lifestyle they have today. So most people didn't know that. So what we do is we teach you how to build that. But see, here's the, here's the dilemma in America, okay? I want to show you something right here. See, these statistics are from the U.S. Census Bureau. See, it's not John. It's not Mighty Khan. I don't want you to be talking about Mighty Khan said. See, this is the U.S. government. They said that the average 50-year-old has $43,797 saved up in their investment account. Well, think about it. If they pay six or 700000 by 65, they're not going to make it. See, they're way behind. Most Americans are far behind on retirement, but they gave me another alarming statistic. They said out of 100 people, see, out of all 100 people, they start working at 25 and go to 65. Only 4% of these people have enough money to retire and never go back to work. So that would mean in the wealthiest country in the history of the world, 96% of people are failing at personal financial success. There's more money here than anywhere else in the world, and most people are broke. Why is that? It's because they lack financial literacy. I want you to think about this. See, we live in a capitalistic system. But what do you really know about capitalism? See, you can go from kindergarten all the way to the 12th grade, and it's never mandated that you learn anything about business, money, capitalism, or finances. Now think about that. And then you can go and get an advanced degree. You can get a college degree and pay $50,000, dollars 80000 And if you don't elect to take financial courses, you will not know anything about money. See, education is subject-specific. See, just because you have a degree in medicine don't mean you know anything about working on cars. Just because you have a degree in law doesn't mean you know anything about social work. And just because you have a degree at all doesn't mean you know anything about money. So at my econ, we're going to give you what is called a financial literacy. See, think about it. I know people that pay $60,000 for education and they have no financial literacy. That is a huge problem. See, in order for capitalism to work, 90% of the people have to be oblivious to the rules. So because a lot of people ask me this question, well, John, why don't they just teach this stuff in school? Well, if they did, we couldn't be a capitalistic system. Because, see, that's the very nature of capitalism. Someone is getting capitalized upon. And that's always the person that has the least amount of information in the system. But now, let's keep moving. See, people need more personal financial success for what? Lifestyle? They need it for retirement and their dreams and goals. Some people have gotten so beat down, they stop dreaming and they stop setting goals. But now here are the obstacles. See, we've already proved this. The traditional strategy is not working. Go to school. Get a good education. Get a good job. Work hard. Everything is going to be okay. Not today. You have to do a little bit more. We have to add something to the mix. So people need more cash flow and they need better financial strategies. See, sometimes people will say, well, John, isn't this what a financial planner will do? They'll help me get straight, right? No. The financial planner can only help you if you have some money. See, they're going to say, this is what you need to do. You need to invest this amount of money, and I'll invest it for you and get you straight. Well, your first problem is you don't have any extra money above and beyond your taxes and your debt and living, so you don't have any money to make the traditional financial services work for you. So my econ is a system designed to help you solve that problem. See, that is the number one problem in the world. See, in business, you got to find the biggest problem you can find, and you create a solution. Well, 96% of the people are failing that personal financial success. I would say that that is the number one product in the world. How do I know? People spend 8 to 20, 10 hours a day working for it. They spend fifty, sixty thousand dollars $60,000 on education trying to get it, and then they fail at it. So what I say, let's teach people how to get it personal financial success. So we're going to do it by using three smart cash flow strategies. The first one, we're going to teach you something called income shifting. Now, what in the world is that? Income shifting is when you shift your income from higher tax brackets 
to lower tax brackets, gives you more money on a monthly basis. Typically, we can save a person somewhere between $200 and $1,000 per month on the taxes that they pay right now within 10 to 14 days without selling anything, without recruiting a soul, and without knowing a lot of people. What if we could put two, three, four, five hundred dollars per month back into your pocket? Let's say next week you went back to work and somebody says, well, hey, how you doing today? You say, I'm doing fabulous. I'm doing income shifting. And they say, well, what in the world is that? And you say, I took, I took that assistant. It saved me 400 bucks a month on taxes. I'm taking that and paying off my car, and I'm going to have it paid off two years early. And you just stop. What do you think the next part of that conversation is going to be? Well, hey, wait a minute. Tell me how that works. I want to do it too. So now you pique their curiosity, and you pass them to the professional like myself. You get them on this webinar. We do a live meeting, whatever we got to do. And now if they decide to buy the cash flow management system, guess what? You're going to get a referral fee, and that's going to be called business income. So that's another stream of income for you. So we're going to save you several hundred dollars on taxes within 10 to 14 days. That's cash flow. We're going to show you how to make business income by showing other people how to lower taxes and get free money. See, how can, how can a business be any better than that? Thirdly, we're going to teach you passive income. See, residual income is the most important income that you will ever build in your life. Here's why. See, one day you're going to stop working and you're going to want some money. You can't work all your days of your life. You have to build income that's repetitive or perpetual. You spend 30 years to 40 years of your life working for the wrong type of income. What do I mean? It's called linear pay. Here's how it works. You work one hour, you get paid for one hour. You work one week, you get paid for one week. But if you don't work, you don't get paid. I don't ever want to go back to that. Why? Because if I ever stop working, I stop getting paid and bills don't stop coming. You have residual bills. Why don't you have residual income? So at my econ, we teach you how to build some. But let's keep moving. Let's talk about the income shifting strategy. See, Americans lose a third of their income to taxes before they ever spend a dime to take care of their family. Now, think about that. You got $5,000 a month gross income, but because of taxes in the system, you're going to lose $1,500. So all you have is $3,500 left to spend. Well, that tax issue causes a cash flow problem. You, it's hard for you to save money. So now when you need a reliable form of transportation, what happens? You mess around, and you can't buy a car, so you got to finance it. Let's say you go out and you need to buy a house. You don't have 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 100,000, 200,000 sitting aside. What do you got to do? You got to get a mortgage. So now you look up. you in debt. So the tax issue causes you to go into debt in this country. Well, now you start to lose another third of your income to just interest payments. Most of the house notes what? Interest. Most of the car note is what? Interest. Most of the credit card is what? Interest. So now you got 30% going to taxes and 30% going to interest, which is just the right for you to owe somebody money. And now you got 60% of your income going to absolutely nothing. How in the world can you win that way? See, the system is not designed for you. You got to learn a different set of rules. You've been playing on the wrong team, but we're going to teach you tonight how to get to the winning team. You got to start understanding how the capitalist system works. So what we're going to do is help you shift dollars from taxes to positive cash flow using two unique methods. The first thing, we're going to help you correct tax withholding. We're going to talk about why that's important. Number two, we're going to help you maximize, 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 maximize business deductions. That's key. See, a lot of times people say, well, why is that important? See, you got to get more deductions. The reason you lose so much to taxes is you don't, you're not on the good playing field. You're on the losing team. So now let's talk about this. Let me go right here and kind of show you something. You got to understand this right here, okay? The IRS says this, not John. It says big refund, big tax bill. I want to ask you a question. Have you ever gotten a refund, a tax refund? I ask people, and I say, well, do you think it was good or do you think it's bad? They always say, woo, it was a good thing. And then sometimes they do say it's bad, and I say, well, why? And they say, well, it wasn't big enough. But here's the problem. When you get a tax refund, that means you overpaid your taxes. If you don't believe me, if you just read this, this tells you that 80% of people in this country get a refund, and they overpay their taxes. But if you pull your most current tax return, and you just go to the second side of your 1040, and go down to line 75, 
and it talks about where your refund is, and at the big, 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 bold letter, it says the amount you what? Overpaid. Now, my question to you is do you want to overpay your taxes, or do you want to give them what you're supposed to give them? Obviously, that's a silly question, right? You just want to pay what you're supposed to pay. So we're going to help you fix that by filling this baby out properly. Most people have this thing filled out wrong. This is why they get a tax refund. But now, here's a question of the day. How do you minimize what you're supposed to pay? Well, that comes in right here. We're going to teach you how to master the common tax deductions of a home-based business. And this is extremely important. See, don't think that I'm trying to talk you into something and we're trying to course you. We're not going to beg you to get in my econ. If you tell us, heck no, you don't want to get in tonight, that's fine. We're still going to love you. But here's the problem. I have not paid 5% of my income in taxes in the last decade because of what my econ has taught me. As a matter of fact, I went several years and paid absolutely nothing legally because I had more tax deductions. See, there is no law that requires you to pay taxes. The only time you pay taxes is when you don't have enough deductions and credits to outweigh tax liability. But let me show you something. Let me give you an example so I can make it plain so you can understand this. Because I don't want you at the end of this presentation talking about you got to think about it. Ain't nothing to think about unless you see if something wrong. If you just like paying high taxes, then okay, go ahead and do that. Please do something for me. But let me show you something. Let's say you make fifty thousand dollars a year. I'm gonna give you an example of a mother of two. Fifty thousand dollars a year. Okay. So she's going to file her taxes. She's going to get what is called a standard deduction. So she's going to file head of household. That's roughly about $10,000. So we minus that, bam, that's down to $40,000, okay? Now, you also get $4,000 per person that's dependent on the income in your house. So it's three people, mother and two kids. So that's $12,000. That brings us down to $28,000. That $28,000 is your taxable income. At this point, it's absolutely nothing that you can do to lower your taxes. But now, you can't say, well, I got a good tax man. Well, he can't do very much. All he can do is look at box one on the W-2 and put it there, box two and put it there, box three. If he does anything other than that, he's doing something shady that might get you in trouble. But now, how do you minimize this? See, in America, there's two types of tax systems, one for the employee and one for the business owner. The employee works and makes money, and then they pay taxes first, and then they pay expenses. Well, that's what everybody's on. 95% of the people are on that system. But look at this. As a business owner, you work and you make money, but then you pay expenses. And if you don't spend all the money up, you pay taxes on what's left. Those are two entirely different worlds. Well, look at some of the expenses that you can write off that you cannot do as an employee, driving your car. So let's say we drove 20,000 miles for the year, okay? We're going to show you how 80 to 90% of the time to make that a tax deductible event, it only takes two to five minutes a day. Well, now that's, that's 16,000 miles, okay? Now you get at least 50 cents per mile. That's a $8,000 tax deduction. Well, how does that help you? When you file your taxes, you can now attach a Schedule C, and now that's going to take the 28,000 in this example down to 20, and now you pay taxes on 20 as opposed to 28. Do you want some? See, you shouldn't have to think about that. That's just something you should automatically want to do if the law will allow you to do this. And we have a curriculum set in place and a whole platform to teach you how this works. But then we're not done. What about interest on the car note? That's another thousand. That takes you down to nineteen thousand. Well, what about this? Communication. Do you have a cell phone? Yes. Do you have internet? Yes. See, we pick some things that you already spending money on anyway. It just becomes formally non tax deductible to what? Tax deductible. So now that's another thousand. Bam, we take you down to about eighteen thousand. Okay? What about these meals and entertainment? I want you to think about that. See, a lot of times when I get here, people get a little confused. They say, Well, John, I don't know. I don't know if that really works that way. Let me show you something. This is the actual tax code. It says what entertainment expenses are deductible. It says entertainment includes any activity that's generally considered to provide entertainment, amusement, or recreation. Stop right there. Does anything in your life fit that description. But just in case you wasn't sure, they gave you some more examples. Examples include entertaining guests at nightclubs, social, athletic, and sporting clubs, at theaters, at sporting events, on yachts, yachts, yachts. I got stuck on yachts. Or on hunting, fishing, vacation, and other similar trips. And then it starts talking about entertainment may also include meeting the personal living or family needs of individuals, such as providing meals. The 4th of July is coming up in a few days. You will be celebrating and barbecuing. How would you like to write it off on your taxes? 
So I tell people, you around here celebrating Independence Day, but you have absolutely no financial independence. I see that as an oxymoron. That don't make no sense. See, we got to go get some financial independence. And at my econ, we teach you how that works. So that might be another $3,000. That takes us down to about 15000 So now look at this. You got travel. We go on vacation at least once or twice a year. Well, now that's another $3,000. We're down to $12,000. Well, look at this. Wages. Do you have any children? I got a trick question. Do they cost you money or do they make you money? We show you how to get up to a $6,300 tax deduction for feeding, clothing, and taking care of your children. This could even be grandkids. Well, now when you look at this, ladies and gentlemen, in this example, that's $12,000 in tax deductions. Well, in this example, we went all the way down to zero. So we made $50,000 and paid absolutely zero what? Zero taxes. Do you want some? See, sometimes when I get here, though, people say, well, I don't know, John. Does it really work that way? Let me show you something. Let's make sure we get it plain. See, I don't want you to be talking about John said. I don't want you to say my econ said. Look at this. Have you ever heard of USA and today? See, they had an article March 7, 2016, just a few months ago. So this is not some old, outdated information. It says 27 profitable companies that paid absolutely no taxes. Whoa, profitable mean they made money, right? Well, now, they, just in case you wasn't clear, they gave some examples. They let you know who it was. They told on them. Look at this. United Airlines, have you ever heard of them? What about American Airlines? Have you ever heard of them? What about GM? I'm sure you know General Motors, okay? What about Hewlett Packard? They, these numbers are in millions. They made hundreds of millions of dollars and paid no taxes. Why? Because they got tax deductions. You don't. See, if you, if they ain't paying none, why in the world do you want to pay some? See, I don't know whether it's right, wrong, fair, unfair. Here's what I do know. This is what the system allows you to do, and you need to start changing the, your, your team on the playing field so now you can do this and pay no taxes. And this is what we teach people at My Econ, and this is what you don't want to miss. Don't miss this, okay? Now, we went from 28000 all the way down to 20000 right? So that means we had $28,000 in tax deductions. But look at this. On your W-4, this is the second side. You can now put that down as adjustments to income. So now every $4,000 on this form will give you a one new allowance on this form. So in this example, 28000 divided by 4, what we got? 7. So now you got 7 new allowances that you couldn't qualify for before. Oh, my God. Well, now your check going up two, three, four, five hundred dollars $500 per fall on your job. It don't matter how many people you know. It don't matter if you're a salesperson. It don't matter if you like to talk. It don't matter if you shy. It don't matter if you recruit some folks. It don't matter if you sell some product. Did you hear me? You see, that's a financial strategy that can change your life. See, just what if, what if, what if, what if you take that cash flow and do something useful with it? Let me show you. Let's say you take that extra $600 per month back into your paycheck and drop it into your investment account. Now you over 15 years, you got a $208,000 difference that you would not have had if you didn't do that system. Well, what if you had been doing this the lifetime of you working? Income shifting. You took the extra $600 per month and dropped it into your investment account, you'd have $895,000. You would already be close to a millionaire right now. You see, you can't afford not to do this. If the law will allow you to, I would say you should. It is legal, it is moral, and it is ethical. But now you can do the second side. Now let's talk about getting busy. See, we got a system, a software system called the Cash Flow Manager. What this system will do is build you a debt elimination plan, and it puts your debts in order, which one to pay off first. So now remember, within 10 to 14 days, you picked up what? An extra 600 bucks a month in this example. So now it says take that extra 600 and drop it with the $545 car payment. Well, now look what happened. In 15 months, the $17,000 car is wiped out with most of that being on what? The government's dying. They helped you pay your car off. Do you want some? Now, the more you use this system, the more cash flow it creates. Now you got $1,145. Now what could you do? You take that and add it to the 200 bucks a month on the visa. Well, now the $8,000 visa is paid off in six months. Do you want some? You should not have to think about that. But look at this. The $200,000 mortgage is paid off in a little over six years. 
It would have taken you 30 years. Well, now you're 100% debt-free. You paid off $225,000 worth of debt, and you got $2,500 per month in free cash flow. What could you do with that? You can take an extra, that extra money every year and buy a rental property for the next 10 years, and now you got a half a million dollars worth of real estate. You could take that money, drop it into your investment account. You got a portfolio that now you got something to talk about. Or you can get 10 people together, all y'all do the same thing. Now you buy yourself a hotel, a Marriott franchise. See, do you want some? That's what my econ is all about. So remember, I said you had to have a business, right? So let me just show you how that works. What we do is we go right here. This business has a platform that shows you how to become a business owner. So it has a storefront where you can actually have people buy things from you, okay? So now we got identity theft protection. We got roadside assistance. Do you think people need that? Absolutely. We got credit restoration. Do you think people need that? Absolutely. You sell that product, they get a, new, a better credit score within 60 days, and now you get a $100 commission. We got free and discount legal services, 1,000 retail stores, Macy's, Sam's Club, Walmart, Best Buy. What about book and travel? We're not trying to make you a travel agent, but here's how it works. You hear somebody at work talking about going on a trip to Vegas. Well, what you say is, hey, I got a contract with Priceline. It really helped me out if you go through my site. So now they go right here and book their trip. They get the same great, wonderful deal. You ain't got to worry about when they leave and when they're coming back, customer service, none of that. You ain't got to collect no money. And now you get a $30 commission. Just that simple, okay? We also got nutrition products. We're not one of those companies that make you buy $100 a month of it. It's all in your you give it away, you got so much of it, then you go knocking on somebody's door that, that's going to order the stuff from you. They, you hear the TV on, you knocking, boom, 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 boom. They ain't picking up the, the, the doggone thing. They ain't coming to the door. This is not that deal. But what we do is now you got a platform that puts you in business. Now you qualify for the tax advantages of a home-based business. Now you're able to put new allowances on your W-4. Now within 10 to 14 days, your check goes up two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight hundred dollars per month. Now you take that cash flow, pay off all your car notes, credit cards, student loans, and your mortgages. Did you hear me? But now, what if you just decide to also make some commissions in this business? What if you just start sharing this business with other people? So now, you can sign up for our world-class business income system, okay? Now, typically, we sell this, okay, for much more than you're going to be able to get it tonight. You're going to be able to get this for as little as about $115, $120 or so to get into this business, okay? That's going to give you everything that we're talking about. It's going to give you the cash flow manager software, build your financial plan. It's going to have a million dollars worth of identity theft protection. You're going to free and discount legal services, income tax services, credit education, plus millions of people could benefit from that. Now, remember, within 10 to 14 days, your check is going to go up two, three, four, five hundred dollars $500 per month, so it didn't cost you anything in reality to build this business. So you join this business, and then everyone pays $34.95 a month to maintain the site, the system, the software, and everything that we have. So now that's 100% tax deductible. And then you could also, in a few days, you'll be able to sign up for our other system that also add our online marketing system. The total cost will be $199, but your cost tonight is the $120. We don't have that package yet, but it's coming. So now you can get that and get 15 months' worth of our online marketing system to be able to market on Facebook and all that kind of stuff. But now, here's how you make money. You see, you don't want to be in business all by yourself. You can make money on products and services. But here's the thing. You want to do what's successful in American business. See, when you look at all the businesses you see, they have a network. It's not just one store. So you should build a network, not a network of people that want to sell travel, not a network of people that want to sell coffee. You're building a network of people that want to lower taxes, cut debt, and build an investment account. Those people are everywhere. So now, the first two people you enroll will get you promoted to what is called an EVP, okay? You make up to 100% of the products and services on your website and up to 85% on your team, okay? Now, here's where it really gets good. Now, you make $50 every time you personally enroll somebody in this system, and as an override, you make a $25 override to infinity, the key word being infinity. It does not stop. And then every time the counter hits seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, bam, we hit you with a $500 bonus. If the people have bought our upgraded package with the online marketing system, then that's going to be a $1,000 bonus. Did you hear me? So now, this is a great deal. Now, so my econ is not just a business. 
where you can cut your taxes. It is a business where you can now build a tremendous income. So if I go here, I put this site together to just kind of give you an example, not to project income, but just so you can see. See, this is a video of us issuing Brian Bean his first $10,000 check in a week, not in a month, in a week. You see? So we got people making all kind of money in this deal. Look, these are a lot of people on my metro Detroit area team, okay? So they got what is called the Comma Club. They got paid more in excess of $1,000 in one week, okay? Now, we got other people here. Look, Brian Bean got a big one, 12568 4703 here, 11862 for this guy. Okay, we can just keep on going. That's me with the Charlotte, North Carolina team, okay? But here's what you want to understand, ladies and gentlemen, okay? See, at the end of the day, you want to understand this. We cut checks. We just want to know, do you want one with your name on it? See, we didn't get you on the phone to try to figure out what you think about this. We already know it works. We just want to know, do you want some? See, we're not going to try to beg you to get in my econ. We would love you to, but if you don't, that's okay. But here's my thing. Don't make it a my econ issue, okay? See, if you can minimize your taxes, do you really think you need to do that? Absolutely. Do you think you need to get up out of debt? Absolutely. Do you think you need to invest some money for the thing called retirement? Absolutely. See, then you need to do my econ. But now let me give you another example before I close. See, the real money is in the residual income, okay? So let me just show you that very quickly here, and then we're done, okay? You get 5 to $10 a month on every active associate on your team. What if we go out here and build a team of 1,000 people that lower taxes, lower debt, and build investments? Now, sometimes when I put that number out there, people say, oh, man, John, see, you know, I don't know. That's a lot of people. Well, think about it. Over the next three to five years, we find 10 people that build a team of 100 folks that want to cut taxes, cut debt, and build investments. Well, now you got 1000 Well, now you make $8 per month on every active associate. So now you got $8,000 per month residual income, and you own that book of business, which makes you about $100,000 a year, and you can sell a business. For what? For 10 times what it makes you in a year. So you would actually be, in this example, a millionaire. But it's not done. That's not even the end of the story. What if they have six to 10 customers that buy one product or service on that website? That gives you an additional $3,000 per month. Now you're at $11,000 a month in income residually. But it doesn't stop there. What if 20% of the people find one new financial success membership sale a month? Well, now that makes you another 6000 so now you got $17,000 a month in residual income. And think about this. 99.9% .9 of this income has nothing to do with you. That's called long money. That's when you get paid when you sleep. That's when you get paid on vacation. That's when you get paid even when you retire. And then if something happens and you expire, then your kids still get paid forever. See, that's how Warren Buffett still getting paid when his kids are going to get paid when he dies. See, that's how Henry Ford built a business 100 years ago, and his grandbabies get paid today because he built leverage. He built residual. See, I can look at my family. They had, uh, they had 90 plus years of people working, and everybody was broke. My father worked for 30 years. His father before him worked for 30 years. His father worked 30 years. That's 90 years of working, and everybody was broke. Nobody was a millionaire. Nobody was a hundred thousand there. Nobody was barely a ten thousand there. Did you hear me? See, I had a problem with that. We must have been doing something wrong. How in the world do we work for dog on near a century and everybody got broke? You see, they did the wrong principle. They built linear pay forever. You got to build leverage and you got to build residual. So you need to get with the person that got you on this call. Get the personalized website. Get the world-class business income system. It takes less than five minutes to get you signed up. We don't have to send nothing to you. You get it instantly. And then sometime in the next 24 to 48 hours, we're going to take you through a quick start, and we're going to get on the 48-hour plan, and you can change your life. You're going to get a million dollars worth of identity theft protection. You're going to get free and discount legal services. You're going to get income tax services, credit education. I'm tired of talking about the services you get so much. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to invite you to come on down, and I want to welcome you to personal financial success. See, my name is John Pettiford. See, I went out and became a millionaire with this system, and I want to help a 1,000 people do the same thing. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to cut this off here. I'm going to cut the recording off, so now we can go through.